Hi guys, my name is Mercedes and welcome to my channel. Today we do a 10 minute inner thigh workout, which is part of the Back to You series. All you need is a mat and yourself. Let's get started. Okay guys, let's get started. On our elbows today, engage the core muscles and now stretch out your right leg and point the toe as much as you can and stretch that leg. Now we're gonna go to the outer side and closing back in and coming up. So nice circular movements. Try to keep your hips still, feeling those ab muscles working. Now the real action happens when you're closing. So close and feel those inner thigh muscles. Good. Keep on breathing. Working the leg muscles. Give me four more. Four. Four, three. Four, two. And last one. Now we're gonna go reverse. So first we go down, sides, close, and down. Good. So the action happens at this moment when you're closing in. Feel those inner thighs and down. Keep on breathing. Now you can make the circles as big as you feel that is good for your body. You should not have pain in the hips. Give me four more. For three, for two, keep on pointing the toe, and last one. All right, now keep your leg up. We're gonna open and close a little bit. Here we go. Open, close, open, close, good, open. Keep on breathing. Four, three, two, and one. Give me eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, good. Coming down. Now we go straight to the other side. Okay, good. So on the left side, point that toe, stretch that leg. And going for the outer circles first. And coming up. Down and out. And good. Keep on breathing, keep those hips still, remember. Engage the core muscles. Feeling the inner thigh muscles when you're closing, closing, closing. And right back up, good. Give me four more. Four, three. Four, two, and last one. Now we come for the reverse circle, going down, out, close, down, out. Now feel the inner thigh muscles close, down, out, close. Give me four more, four, four, three, four, two, and last one. Good, now you're gonna open, close a little bit. Open, close. Point that toe. Stretch that leg. Good. Keep on breathing. Four, three, two, last eight. Here we go. Four, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and last one. All right, good. Do you feel the burn? Because I feel the burn. <laughs> All right, good. Now, so you're gonna lay down on your sides. And I want you to really 
have your left arm in line with your left shoulder. So we can lay down on the left side, the right side, doesn't matter that much. I'm gonna start with the left side, so the right leg is on top. So now you're gonna have your upper body in line with your lower body. And I want you to bend the lower leg and the top leg is straight. Toe is pointed. Now turn your right leg a little bit out. And from here, we're just gonna kick up the leg and coming down with resistance, feeling those inner ties. Here we go, coming up and slowly down. Up, slowly down. So with the resistance, your inner leg muscle should really work. Up, good. Give me four more. For three, for two, and last one. Good. Now stretch both legs out. We go slowly two counts up, two counts down with the right leg. Here we go. One, two, going down for two. So this is like a scissor movement. So I really want you to feel those inner thigh muscles when you close and when you're coming up. Good. Give me four more. For three. For two. And last one. Good. All right, coming down, laying down. And bring your hand under your head to support your neck. And now we are going to lift both legs up off the floor. And you're just gonna come down with your lower leg and coming up, touch the heel, and down. Up, good, and up, down. Try to keep the top leg as still as possible for four, for three, for two, and last one. Now you're gonna hold it there, hold it up. Let those heels touch. Hold it for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Now we go straight to the other side. Okay, so now we are on the other side. Coming onto your right elbow in line with your right shoulder. Bend the lower leg, stretch the left leg. Here we go. Turn out the left leg and Kick up and going slowly down. Kick up and slowly down. So it's not about how high you kick the leg. It's about the control that you feel in your inner thigh muscles. Good. Keep on breathing. Give me four more. For four. For three. For two. And last one. Good. Stretch out both legs. And now we go slow, two counts up, two down. Here we go. Down, up, and going down. And up, and down. Good. Up, and down. Stretch those legs. Point the toes. Good, four more, four. For three, for two, and last one. All right, good. So now lay down, and now you're gonna lift both legs up. Here we go. Lift them up, lower the leg down, touch the heel, and close. Close. Good. So this is the ultimate leg burner, at least for the inner thighs. You should feel something in the inner thighs. Good. Give me four more. For four. For three. For two. And last one. Hold it. Hold it close to legs. For eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, 
and one. Good. Coming down. And now we can come to the final stretch. So you can open your legs a bit for a straddle stretch, we'd like to call it. So you open the legs as wide as you feel that is comfortable. And from there, we are going to the front. So you're just slightly walking to the front. And it's not about going as far as you can. It's about these inner thigh muscles. So we're just stretching the inner thigh muscles. Focus on your breath. And just feel the energy from the workouts. Good, so slowly coming back up. And close your legs. Join me in the lotus position. And breathe in. And exhale. So thank you guys for joining this workout. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments, subscribe to our channel, and I hope to see you soon.